Wanna play chicken? Good morning. Well, today's the day we start watering in chemical. Start start of a fun process. I'm gonna go over and grab the hoses that we need to hook up the wheel lines. We're gonna get them put in place. We're actually gonna start them until about noon, but I wanna have everything set up, so all I gotta do is go flip the switch, turn on pretty much pressure and fix any problems that might come up. So now let's get going. Yeah! All loaded up. Well, now I'm just waiting for Skyler to get here. We got to move one of the transmissions on this wheel line. It's not perfectly straight. It's off about a row. Start the year, we're gonna straighten them all out, put them all down in the same row. They'll probably end up getting off just because of the tires spinning in the mud, but we'll come down here and take a look and see which one it is that we need to move. But they're pretty heavy. I don't like moving those by myself. Wanna play chicken? Yeah. <laughs> oh yeah, you did shave. Look at you. One, two, three. You wanna go that way and I'll go this way? Let's do it! Woo! Stuck! Huh? That was fun. On the next project. Well, that's not supposed to be here. <laughs> that's supposed to be on there. We may have had that old faithful. Well, it's official. It's watering season. Uh, we're gonna do probably a two and a half to three hour set on here. And then we gotta move them again. We gotta try and get across here. We got seven days to water it in, so we're gonna have to get after it. Now we get to see if Skylar's weld held on welding on that riser top. Let's see how good of a welder you are, Skylar. Well, Skylar's riser's not too bad. Just some real, real little pinholes. Those should rust over, shouldn't be a problem. We'll see. Well, I'm walking out here because we've got ourselves a sprayer out next to one of the wheels on this wheel line. Either the rivets on the pipe are leaking or the hub. Hopefully it's the hub because I've got extra wheels that I can put on and that'll be an easy fix. But if it's those rivets, I at the moment do not have an extra pipe. So I got to steal a pipe from somewhere else or, well, run to town, I guess. And it's coming out the pipe. Of course it had to be the pipe what I don't have. So I'm actually gonna go steal a pipe off across the tracks, the other field. How we doing, Skylar? Doing good. Woo! Living the dream. Nothing like hell week. Well, we got the first pipe switched out. We'll just throw it by the road, leave it here, come back and get it. It looks like the metal end, we should be able to weld it. Phil probably went and got the transmission that we gotta change. Skylar walked down and got a hole in the transmission pipe. It's spraying straight down and washed out spuds. If we have too much water in one spot, it'll actually cause the spuds to rot in the ground. So that's the next project. Hey Skylar, why don't you clean this thing once in a while? Look at how dirty this thing is. America. Well, that wasn't fun. Well, Time to pack it out. Look at that. Nice and pretty. Guaranteed to not break this oh, yeah, year. Hopefully. 
Time for attempt number two. This is definitely gonna go better. <laughs> well, no I wonder why head. we're so scared. Maybe not. <laughs> he keeps jinxing us. Bug bird. Woo! Front row seat to all the action. Ooh, you're a little wet. Let me clean you off there. There you go. Philip just gave me a ride back to the commander. Just got done walking two of the wheel lines. This guy was walking the other two. Plugging nozzles, had a drain I had to fix. <sighs> Starting wheel lines on spuds. I don't know what it is. Drain, we had one pipe that was broken and that was it. But spuds, <laughs> it's just, this is just how it goes. It's time to go move wheel lines. It's been three hours, they just turned off. Well, about 10 minutes ago, so they should be drained by the time we get there, so. Wind's picked up enough to decide we don't want to run those wheel lines, we'll end up with a water skip. And so we decided to put it off until we're going to go back out about 8.30 and start that up. So I ran home and changed my clothes because those other ones, just being out in the field with that chemical on there, I don't like to expose, take any chances of exposing anyone. So I went home and changed my clothes, got daxed in here. Hello. We're going to go cultivate for some spuds for a few hours and then we'll... Uh, I'll run him home and then I'll go back and turn on the wheel lines and unplug nozzles. Well, Dax and I, we're in the cultivator going. As you can see right there, their uh, potatoes are poking through. So we have to be real careful that we don't really bury them. I mean, a little bit of dirt on top of them is fine. They'll push back through, but we want to make sure we don't bury them too deep. We also don't want uh, like drag pipes, what pulls off the hill. We gotta make sure there's not too much pressure that's wanting to rip off those stems. Uh, that just will set back the potatoes. Big problems. Well, it's that time. Let's light her up. That wasn't quite as satisfying as I was hoping. This lighting definitely is not working. It's the light back there. I need to see up here. Guess we better go take care of that. They're pointing pretty much straight out. My implement's pretty much straight down. So, <laughs> simple math or science, logic. Let's go with logic. I need to make them point down. Down. Yeah, that's, that's much better. Oh yeah. Big difference. I don't know if you can see right there, but that center shovel has raising up on the shank. We'll walk over here and see if we can move it back to place. Do, 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 do. Don't put that in, please. All right. Here's what it's supposed to look like. And here's what this one's done. And here, well, it's <laughs> definitely plenty wet. Probably are generating a few dirt clods that are Gonna come back to bite me at potato harvest. I'm not gonna lie, that's gonna be lots of fun. And you guys will probably get to see that too, so kudos to you, I guess. Get that level. Well, I'm gonna have to put you down for a sec. Stay. Stay. Good camera. Alright. Good job. I think we're good to go now. Onward! Let's go see. And there it goes. Better go flag that one. That's a lot bigger rock than I thought it was going to be. <laughs> I thought it was just a little rock. Or else I wouldn't have uh, let that go through the machine. Don't want to break anything, but a little late for that now. The mark where the rock is, just in case we don't get it out of the field. <laughs> well, you know, I could not be lazy and just roll it over right here. So it's not even in the spud rows. That'd probably be a better bet. Anyways, as I was saying before that rock rudely interrupted us.
That was a lot of talking just to explain flushing to you. We've also, we also got some blah, blah. Man, I got some uh, sweet hair going on here. All the, I'm driving the blah, 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 blah. One of the chemicals that we'd like to use for weed suppre suppre blah, 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 suppression. Babe, please don't. 